Hey there, engineering fans. Today we're going through the seven types of bridges every engineer should know about. Let's start with beam bridges. These are the simplest around, offering straightforward construction. They're economic for short spans, but across longer distances they require supportive piers, which can make them less visually appealing than other types. Next, truss bridges. These rely on triangular frameworks for strength and adaptability. They might not look as fancy as other bridges, but they're incredibly strong and cost-effective. Next, arch bridges. These familiar structures use compression and curved shapes to handle heavy loads effectively. Ideal for medium spans, they're durable and work with various materials. From ancient Roman aqueducts to modern designs, arch bridges have stood the test of time. Tide arch bridges combine features of arch and suspension bridges, offering robust support with less stress on the end support structures. A versatile choice for many projects. Cantilever bridges extend outwards, with arms supported at only one end. They're perfect for crossing tricky landscapes without disrupting underlying waterways. Suspension bridges can span vast distances using minimal piers. Iconic and inspiring, they use massive cables to hang the road from tall towers. Last but not least, cable-stayed bridges. Think of them as suspension bridges' modern cousins. Instead of hanging the road in a big curve, they use straight cables running directly from towers to the road. That wraps up our tour of the seven main types of bridges. Thanks for watching.